Hello guys, I'm back with another brand new video. My name is Haris and you're watching Possible Nam. So guys, as you know, uh, Jurassic World Evolution 2 DLC is out, dominant by sign expansion. And many of the player face random crashes when they launch a game and the game stuck on the loading screen for a few seconds and the game suddenly crash kind of a problems. So I'm gonna discuss all about uh, crashes plus errors. So watch the video till the end and subscribe our channel too for more videos and without any waste of time, let's start the video so guys first of all uh, we need to uh, simply uh, disable all the uh, background apps running in the background so you need to go to the um, settings options here it is and in here you need to go to the privacy option and in general turn off all of these four settings one by one and down below uh, click on the background apps and turn off all the background apps running in the background so now you need to go to the gaming section and simply go to the game mode and turn on game mode so after this now guys you need to simply open task manager and simply um, free your CPU space from here uh, close users apps running in the background uh, before playing uh, launch your game so my cpu space is already free so i don't need this and after apply this step then you need to simply download the pack link in the description below and after download the pack then simply extract the pack here and then open the pack and here it is uh, there are some folders in this pack and just follow my steps first go to the uh, dx folder and install dx folder in your system accept the agreement click to next install the bing bar is optional so it's up to you click to next and wait for it maybe it takes some time so don't be panicking guys and if this video helps you like this video share this video and subscribe our channel too for more content now it's done click to finish get back and i move to the next folder optimization for your cpu these all are ready files uh, for your cpu so run all of them one by one CPU parallel class disable power shortling game optimization increase CPU performance increase system responsiveness low mid optimization mid high optimization board thread priority power optimization and in the end priority class so now get back and now move to the lasso folder uh, first extract first and then you need to simply uh, install the 64 bit version and after install ISO then you need to simply open it now you need to go to the main option here mark those settings power balance enabled and the second one is active power profile set on high performance just mark those settings and your processing is start now minimize ISO get back and I move to the uh, many softwares uh, in this uh, folder there are two parts first go to the ISLC part open the notepad and read the instruction from here so now open ISLC here it is so guys in here uh, you need to simply click on the stop button first and stop the processing running in the background then you need to simply uh, right here half of your RAM memory I have 8 GB RAM in the system so I write here half of my RAM memory also mark the settings and wanted time resolution set on 0.50 polling it is set on 1000 and just apply the settings click on the start button and it's done now the processing is start now close SLC get back and move to the power control part install it first and then open power control here so guys in here you need to simply set on high performance first and make sure click has the make active button click on it and down below disable all of these settings and just apply the settings and click ok click to close ok so guys the next folder is quick cpu for your cpu extract first install it and then open quick cpu here it is it takes few uh, minutes uh, maybe so don't be panic guys and if this video helps you like this video share this video and subscribe our channel too for more content so guys here it is 
uh, now you see uh, first you need to simply uh, set on system power plan on high performance and make sure click as a make active button and down below all of these priorities set on 100 core parking index turbo boost and frequency scaling index and just apply the settings click ok click to close now get back and now move to the uh, ram optimization folder for your ram run both of the valid file one by one so it's done so guys uh, the pack steps are complete and in the end you need to simply delete some junk or bad files in your system so press win plus r and in here you need to simply type prefetch p-r-e-f-e-t-c-h press ok click to continue control a select all and delete all of these bad files in your system so now it's done so guys uh the steps are complete and in the end you just need to simply restart your pc and you're good to go